hey guys welcome to another vn tutorial in this tutorial we will learn the use of this new curve option how can you use this curve option and uh, you can use this in text and you can use that in images and videos as well but uh, once you uh, choose a video it's dimmed the curved option is dimmed and you cannot tap on that even if you tap on that there just nothing happens so uh, one one person asked me about that that how can he use a curve option on his text so in this video i'm gonna exactly tell you how you can use the uh, curve option for text and video or image as well so let's start with the text first i have a uh, written text you got it and uh, it's already selected in the timeline there are actually two conditions uh, to uh, use this curve option first of all uh, you need to add at least two keyframes and the second is the second condition is that the second on the second keyframe you should change the size of the text and image or video if you keep the same size it will not work let me show you practically how does it work first of all um, I will add a keyframe in the very start of the text here and now I will move little further and I will add another keyframe now you see when as soon as I add second keyframe now I have got the curve option now I can choose any of these but you see it still it is still not working even if I am choose any other curve option from here the reason is quite simple you either have to make the text smaller or bigger now let me make it a little bit bigger like this and place it here now I go to curve and I choose any option you see it got animated actually these curve options are uh, like you see these are kind of graph and how uh, they look uh, they actually make the text animate like this these are actually for the animations now I have chosen damp animation here now if I want to do the same for the picture as well I will choose the picture add a keyframe in the start and then I will add another keyframe and at this place and now I will go to uh, first of all I will increase the size little bit like this and now I will go to curve and I will add the curve option damp 5 from here and now you see the image also started animating now let me play this you can see it's a damp animation and this is how you can use curve in your videos it's a new feature and I knew a lot of people will have difficulties in using this and that's why I created this tutorial on this curve feature. If you found this helpful please don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell icon so when I upload more tutorials about VN you get the notification. Thanks for watching. Stay blessed.